This is Ginger Step. Yeah, that's that's me. Anyway, so we are beginning a new journey on Animal Crossing. And uh, first thing that happens, obviously, is you get uh, taken to this, I guess it's like a some kind of airport. I, I'm guessing it's the airport because I see the D-A-L, which is uh, Dodo Airlines. <laughs> Anyway, I see their logo back there, so I imagine we're at an airport, and we're signing up for a deserted island getaway package from Nook, Inc. So, yeah, this is where our journey begins, and we are here with Tommy and Timmy. I think that's their names. They say, good afternoon. We're so excited to have you here. Have you here? Because the other one, like kind of echoes what one says. It's kind of cute, really. Let us be the first to congratulate you on your wise decision to sign up for this adventure. Welcome to the check-in counter for your deserted island getaway package! There is so much to look forward to, but first, let us introduce ourselves. I'm Timmy with Nook, Inc. And I'm Tommy... We'll be flying to the island with you to help you get settled. Think of us as your partners. We're in it for the long haul. So let's get started, shall we? The first step is checking your application. Is this your first time applying for one of our packages? Uh, we'll just say yes. Understood. Now then, we'll need, uh, we'll need to look up your application. So can we have your name and birthday? All right, so what should my name be? I'm gonna go with Ginger. Are you okay with Ginger Snap? Yeah. I I don't think that that's uh, offensive. And my birthday. There we go. That's my birthday. You would be, of course, putting your info in if, if you were doing this. So, yes, it is. Ginger snap, ginger snap, let's see. Oh, yes, here you are! Our next step will be to take a picture of you. Oh, don't worry. Take as much time as you need to get yourself looking the way, just the way you want. We'll be here when you're ready. All right. And, uh, so, yeah, my skin tone is very light. I don't know if it's that light. Uh, maybe that. Yeah. I'm gonna go with this, because I think it's cute. And I definitely have that color hair, so. Let's see. Uh, eyes. I don't know. I think that works. Nose and everything is fine. And confirm. Okay. Great, you're all set! I'll just go ahead and add a picture to your records and now let's get start talking about your new home. So exciting! You see, we're quite proud of the work that we've done to help you feel comfortable in your new life. Oh yes! In fact, if you want, you can even experience the seasons the same way you're used to them. What I mean is, we have islands in both the Northern Hemisphere and the Southern Hemisphere. We recommend choosing an island that has the same seasonal pattern as your current home. So tell me, Ginger Snap, where do you live now? Definitely North America. Ah, uh, excellent. That information really helps us focus on just the right island for you. So naturally, we'd recommend that you relocate to an island in the Northern Hemisphere. There are a few more decisions to make, 
But does that sound okay to you so far? No, it doesn't! It sounds awful! I don't like it! Wait, actually it does. It sounds great, guys. I really like it. I like this idea. Let's go! Very good. We have a number of lovely, uninhabited islands in the Northern Hemisphere to choose from. Now then, all of our islands are approximately the same size and they're all quite natural. So don't worry whether you'll have enough space or comfort. You can't go wrong. Just follow your instincts and choose an island with a layout that looks appealing. That's how I do it. I'll show you some maps now so you can choose the best one for your new home. Your home. Okay. Don't want a whole lot of rivers. Let's see. I'm thinking... I'm thinking this. Yeah, that's the one I want. Wonderful choice. I can't wait to show it off to you. Ah, but before we depart, we have just one final question for you. If you could bring one thing with you to a, to a deserted island, what would it be? Probably food. How interesting. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, that was just a hypothetical question. Milk Ink will fully cover all of your basic needs. Yes, yes. Perfect timing! Come on! So, yeah, okay, because I didn't read that out. So, yeah, they're calling for me to depart. So, let's all go and board the quote-unquote plane together. Hello, everyone! Thank you for taking this chartered flight as a part of Nook Inc.'s deserted island getaway package! Please sit back, relax, and enjoy a complimentary video presentation about deserted island life. Well. Do 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 do. <laughs> Look at that cute little squirrel. A shooting star. Do 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 do. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of fun being on an island in Animal Crossing. I can't wait to get to my island. Gonna be great, y'all. Woot woot! Loading, loading, loading on the airplane. Loading. Yay! Here we are. Why is it snowing? It should not be snowing. It's April. I think it's because I waited to the last minute to change my time and stuff like that on my <laughs> on my console so it appears we're in january that's all right we'll make up for the lost time it's kind of cool seeing all the snow anyway so now i know you must be incredibly excited to explore your new island home but i have one small request would you please join us for a short orientation session in the nearby plaza our fearless leader himself will be giving a presentation, so I'd hate for you to miss it. Oh, he's fearless? Oh, he sounds like a dictator. Should I be scared? I... I don't know. I feel like... Now, I've got some cute animals with me. I got a purple frog. Hello, purple frog. What's up? We could chat later. I want to see where this is going. Okay, well... Who are you? Follow the guides! Let's hustle! Lyman and what was that the one? Beer? I forget the name. Oh well. Oh, hi Tom Nook. Oh, 
All right. Is that everyone? Let's see. There's only three of us here. Oh, it's Diva. Diva. Diva's here. How about Lyman? Lyman's here. And there's Ginger Snap. Of course. Of course. Great. We're all here. I'll turn it over to you, Mr. Nook. Our three adventurers are ready to get started. Yes, yes. Very good. Let's see. How shall I begin? Yes, of course. Welcome, everyone. Welcome to your new island. My name is Tom Nook, and I am the founder and president of Nook, Inc. Yes, yes. Today is the first day of your new life on this pristine, lovely island, so congratulations. And this is a package deal, hmm? As such, Nook, Inc. staff will always be here to support you and ensure your comfort and safety. Oh. So if I, like, run into any, you know, deadly animals, I'm cool. You'll just have my back, Tom. That's cool. I like it. But, first things first, yes, yes. I'd like each of you to choose a spot of your own. This is the first step to putting down some real roots. I'd like you to dream big. I do have certain connections in construction and real estate, and, ah, uh, but I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's just get started with a simple tent, shall we? Please collect your tent from Timmy or Tommy and then choose a spot to place it. All right. Here you go, Ginger Snap. It's your very own tent. Thank you, Tommy. All right. So I get to look at it. Yada yada. Oh, he's going to give me a map, too. That's handy. Once you put up your tent, please find a way back here and use your new map if you need it. Well, off you go. Hope you find a great spot. Ooh. This is a, apparently a peach island. I love it. And you don't get started with a whole lot of room. So, just be aware of that. All right. I can't tell you to pick up anything. I guess I can't pick up anything yet. I've forgotten about that. Wow. Looks cool. There's a fishy fish. And we're limited where we can go so far because we don't have a lot of, we don't have any bridges. We don't have any inclines. We don't have any kind of way to get across the rivers and stuff or even up ledges because you can see there are ledges over there that we just can't access just yet so yeah let's see and i'm supposed to have a map there's my map hmm you know what i think i'm gonna go to the corner about right here. I think I'm gonna set up shop here. And I can always move it later if I don't like it. Should I put my tin here? Let me imagine it. Yes, that is a great spot. Pristine. I set up my tins! Woot woot! Now I get to find my way. What's up? You're- wait, I got it. Don't tell me. You're Ginger Snap, right? See, I told you. I'm Diva. I gotta tell you. I'm excited to do this whole island thing, you know? You already found a good spot, huh? I was trying to just feel for the best spot, but I was having trouble because every spot feels like the best one. I could have just sit here thinking it over forever, so I grabbed a stick and threw it, and this is where it landed. So now this is my spot. Okay, I know that there's only so far I could throw the stick, but I'm liking this. Looks good to me. Well, if you're sure, let's think about this a little. If I put my tin here... Looks nice, don't it? Looks great. I love it. Yep, it's gonna be your new home, Diva. That's amazing. I can't believe I got such a nice spot! You rock, you know! 
I wonder how that Lyman guy is doing. I bet he... He might be having as much trouble as I was. Maybe you should go see if he needs help, too. Alright. Where is he? There he is. Let's help our buddy out. Hi, eyebrows. Uh, I mean, yeah. Yo, I'm Lyman. You're Ginger Snap, right? Nice to meet you, Chips. Whoa, he calls me Chips, huh? You already set up your tent, eh? I'm still trying to find the perfect spot. I'll be doing some serious cardio, so that's gotta have a lot of fresh air. I think this spot will do the trick, but I don't know. What do you think, Ginger Snap? Looks good. Let's let's get along. All right, let's visualize this with your big old eyebrows. Hey, I like the color of your tent. Looks great. Wonderful. All right, looks like we have a winner. I'm gonna put down stakes right here and never look back, Chips. Oh, Chips. I can't wait till we change that. That is. That was a tough decision. You totally saved my glutes. <laughs> oh, glutes are butt cheek muscles. Yeah, I helped out Diva. I'm like, like, a true champion. I just got here. So I'm not gonna have anything ready, but I'm gonna reward you for once I'm set- bleh, Once I'm settled in. Well, looks like it's time to sprint back to the plaza, Chips. And Tom, Mr. Nook, welcomes us back. Welcome back, everyone. I hope you all found just the right spots to set up your new homes. Totally did, dude. Of course, you can sleep on it for a while, hmm? Really get a feel for how it suits you. And with that taken care of, we can now move on to serious business. Like throwing an island warming party. We'll have it right here in the plaza with a roaring campfire! We'll just need a few supplies to get started, yes? Since we'll all be living here together, this will be a good test of our teamwork. Let's see. Timmy, Diva, Tommy, and Lyman can set up things here in the plaza. Meanwhile, Ginger Snap and I will get to work on gathering firewood and perhaps a little snack. Alright, everyone, let's get to it. Ginger Snap, would you come see me for a moment? Uh oh, I'm in trouble, y'all. I'm in totes trouble. Uh. What did I do wrong? Oh, Ginger Snap, I just wanted to go over what we'll need for the campfire. Oh! Oh, y'all, I thought I was in trouble already. I think roughly ten tree branches should do the trick. You can find them scattered about the island. So when you find one laying on the ground, just press Y to pick it up. Cool. Meanwhile, I'll investigate the peach-like items growing in the trees. I suspect they're real peaches. Yes, they're real peaches, Tom. The really, really real peaches. What is going on with you? Any tree branches you find on the ground or shake out of the trees will work just fine for the campfire. Okay, thank you. I got some peaches. Millions of peaches. Peaches for me. Millions of peaches. Peaches for free. Yeah? No? Okay. Y'all probably don't know that song. But, it's a favorite. It's a favorite of mine. Moving to an island, gonna eat a lot of peaches. Gonna pick me up some stickies. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Peaches. Peaches, peaches. And stick. Boop. And you can also pick up, like, all of this stuff, too. You can craft with it. It's good to have. And, um, of course, you can also sell it. Which, early on, that's what I'll be doing. I'll be selling weeds. Ha 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 that's just how I am. Gotta get your money any way you can in this game. So... How many do I have? Seven. I need more gnat. And hey! Here's a rock! I found a rock! 
More peaches. Peach, peach, peach. Oh, maybe a cobbler later. What do y'all think? Should I make a cobbler? It'd be cool if you could make one. I don't think that's an option here. If it is, I haven't seen it yet. Later on, I'll be able to, like, craft things with the peaches, though. Like, umbrellas and dresses and all kind of stuff. Let's see how much I got. Alright, I got 18 peaches and plenty of sticks. So, yeah, let's go back here. Oh, good, good, Ginger Snap. It looks like you've, collect you've managed to collect up the tree branches. You found even more than I asked. Ha ha. I only need 10, but I'm sure you'll find good use for the rest. Oh, yes, I will, Tom. I will. Yes, yes. That should be plenty for our campfire. You made quick work of that. I'm quite glad that I'll be sharing this desolate island with such a hard worker. Oh! -ho. And speaking of surviving on a desolate island, our next task is to round up something to snack on. Well, honey, let me tell you. Let me tell you something. I am way ahead of you. Yeah, and my dog is very happy about it. My dog is barking with joy and glee right now because I found the peaches. Millions of peaches. Peaches for me. Peaches for free. Gonna eat a lot of peaches. They look like peaches. They even smell like peaches. And they even taste like peaches. In fact, they are 100% without a doubt genuine peaches. So you collect six of them for me? Yeah. Oh, wait, what's this? You've already got it. Yeah, buddy. I have been busy. I have been very, very busy. I'll go ahead and take those off your hands. Hey! My dog is very upset at you, Tom. You just took my peaches. Now, is that everything? Yes, yes, I believe it is. Let's get started with the festivities! Yay! At last, allow me to properly welcome you to your new island. I have participated in many ventures and endeavors over the years, but this might be the most exciting. Helping develop a thriving new community entirely from scratch will truly test my biz business acumen. And perhaps my skills as an outdoorsman, hmm? Oh, 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 Wait, you've never done this before, Tom? I don't know if I'm, uh, comfortable now. I thought you were going to keep me safe and stuff like that, but seems like you're an experienced buddy. Y you seem a little sweaty. Are you okay? Are you okay, Tom? Tom? Are you okay? Now, we might not have the kind of numbers that I originally envisioned, but that just means we have to rise to the challenge. Oh, oh my God. He's got such a lovely determined face. Look at that face. Look at that face. Now, would you mess with that face? I think not. My dog would though. My dog's kind of silly. And I have no doubt that with hard work and perseverance, we'll shape this, I can't talk. We'll shape this deserted island into I suppose we can't call this a deserted island anymore, huh? But what should we call it? What should we call it? I sense a great opportunity. As the first residents of the island, we should be the ones to name it. Yes. Now look at that. That is a very, very strong stance there, Tom. You have got this. You know what you're doing. I feel safer already. And in the spirit of democracy, we should put it to a vote. Majority rules, hmm? Yeah, I'm sure the other two are just going to come up with some great ideas. Yeah, like, let's call it Chip! So, take a little time to think, and when everyone is ready, I'll present your ideas. What should I name this? What should I name this island? 
Huh. Well. It's Peach Allen. So. Should probably call it Cobbler. Right? Maybe not Cobbler. Since there's a bunch of people there that are making Cobbler. Maybe we should call them Cobblers. Even though that's not what Cobbling is. We're just going to go with it. We're going to go with cobbling. Cobbler. Cobbling. Because we're going to be doing a lot of cobbling. And I don't mean cobbling in the traditional sense. I mean making peach cobbling. Cobbler. Cob. Cobbling. Yeah. <sighs> It says cobbing, not cobbling. So I think I need to rethink it. I forgot my L. Cobbling! Cobbling! Yeah. You know what? I am going to... I'm gonna do something silly. I'm gonna all caps the bling because by the time we're done with this, it's gonna be full of bling. That's right. It's gonna have blue roses and all the money. Ka bling! I know, it's silly, but I warned y'all, I'm silly. So, yeah, yeah, kabling is what we're going with. Let's try saying our ideas all at the same time. Ready, go! Swoville! <laughs> Guitar Bureau. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. I, I think I'm, I, I would vote for Guitar Bureau. <laughs> it's a lot better than mine. A splendid variety. Yes, yes. Each one a pot potential gem. Now for the voting. I'll say each name in order and you can clap for the one you think is best. Ginger Snap seems to have the enthusiasm and naming sensibilities. Let's start there. So Ginger Snap suggested... Kabling! Wow, that's an overwhelming positive response. Each and every one of you clapped. I suppose if everyone is in agreement, we should just go with Kabling! <laughs> Sounds great, okay, it rocks absolutely! Splendid. Then from now on, with this island will be known as Kabling! <laughs> well, Ginger Snap, you're, you're silly. You're very, very silly. And since you've proven yourself silly by naming this Kabling... I'd like to rely on you for the other critical decisions that we'll need to make on this island. Oh, Tom. Tom, buddy. Buddy. Critical decisions. Critical decisions should probably be made by your two little... Two little Tom Nooks there. I'm just saying. Yes, yes. I hereby name you the resident representative of Kabling. Yay! Ginger Snap, would you please say a word to us, the new spokesperson for your neighbors? Oh, a word or two. That's about what I would say. Ha ha ha! Oh, they're amused. Hmm, so, we've settled on a name for our island, and we selected our resident representative. It's been a big day, but it's gotten rather late, so let's have a toast. Whoa, what are we drinking? Is that like avocado juice? Huh. Maybe it's supposed to be like pear juice or... I don't know. It's, it's weird and green. Yeah, I've got a beverage in my hand. Let's toast. It's fresh juice made from peaches. Our new resident representative harvested on this very island. Well... Why is it green? 
I think them peaches went bad, Tommy. I, I think they did, Mr. Nook. Then, without further ado, a toast to Kabling and the happiness of his residence. Cheers! Hoorah! We did this, y'all. We did. We got. We got an island. Ah, Ginger Snap, having a good good time. Yes. I know this is all a bit much, so if you're feeling like taking a short nap in your tent, by all means, go ahead. We'll keep the fire burning. Maybe I'll go do that. Sounds good to me, but first you'll probably want this. It's your very own camping cot! You'll want to set it up in your tent before you lie down. Oh, and there are a few packages waiting in your tent as well, hmm? Just a few items that might be useful. To open packages, blah blah blah. And when you're ready, you can crawl into bed. We've got another big day ahead of us tomorrow, so rest up as much as you can tonight. Yes, yes, that's all for me for now. Sweet dreams, sweet dreams, Ginger Snap. All right. Cool. So now I've got something to sleep with, and apparently I've got some stuff in here. Let's see what I got. Ooh, two boxes. Let's see, it seems I have a light and a radio. That's cool. Light and a radio. So let me move this over. Move this over and maybe turn it. Then we'll get a cot going. Ooh, that's a pretty cot. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and go to sleep and uh, off camera I'm gonna go ahead and pick up some sticks and some peaches and gather some stuff and we'll see what we can do with all that tomorrow. All right let's go ahead go to sleep. Rest my head for a little while. Rest. I'm getting sleepy. I'm so sleepy. Oh my god, y'all, it's KK! I'm dreaming of KK! So, he says that you have decided to get away and do an adventure, and that's the way right, Daddy O. You don't need to live by anyone's rules but your own. The world was made for exploring, you know? Living free, being out there, it's a great feeling. Yeah. But take it from a cat who's been on the road. Wait, you're a dog. Okay. Being by your lonesome can grind on the soul. You gotta make friends along the way. Rambling this crazy world is Squaresville without some pals. Yeah, man. Friends are where it's at. Speaking of rambling... I'm doing a bit of that myself. My bad. Maybe it's about time for you to wake up to your new life. Oh, but listen up. That rap that I just gave you about friends is pretty key. You'll dig this island life a whole lot more if you share it with some friends. That's your scene. Yeah. An island paradise with your best pals sounds pretty groovy to me. Cool. When you wake up, you'll be in sync with real time. Dig that island life, and I'll catch you later. Yeah, he's a cool cat that's also a dog. We like KK. We stand KK. That's right. All right, so that is what happens whenever you first start up the game, hopefully, I mean, a, a lot of it's pretty boring. Okay, I'm gonna admit it, it's pretty boring, but 
I mean, that's where we're at. As we go along, it'll get a lot more interesting. I'll be making money. I'll be developing. I'll be doing all kinds of stuff. Finding cool furniture. Finding cool islands with new friends and having people move. So, stay with me. Okay? Just continue to watch. And I promise it'll get better. Okay? I promise. So, without further ado, just remember... To be kind to one another. It doesn't cost you anything. It's free. So be kind. Just be kind, okay? And this has been Ginger Snap. Signing off. See y'all later. Oh.